On October 1, 1985, 10 Israeli F-15 Eagles launched into action during Operation Wooden Leg. Since the PLO's new headquarters facility was located in Tunis, 1,280 miles from Israel, a large airstrike was seen as the only method to prevent the PLO from planning attacks in Israel. Eight of the jets would launch an attack, with two standing by in case of need. The route was planned to avoid U.S. Navy ships in the Mediterranean. Something went wrong out of the blue. Two F-15s had to head back to Israel because they experienced technical difficulties that prevented them from continuing the mission. Since smoke considerably hinders a navigator's ability to guide a GBU-15, the remaining eight aircraft went after the southern position first. This was done so that the northern wind wouldn't blow smoke over the northern targets. The initial wave of bombers successfully hit three targets with every bomb they dropped. The fourth and fifth jets were also successful, while the sixth one missed. Before dropping the final six unguided bombs and heading back to Israel, they took this photograph. The duration of this journey was nearly double that of the 1981 Iraq raid.